Let's show them where we are. We're on the cruiser, yeah. and we're going to catch a col um, what's cola can. Cola we're can. At Safe Air K. So we need to catch these three right there. Plus a cola can. We've already caught one of the other ones. So we're going to go on in. Safe Air Cave is where we are. So, at Safe Air Cave, you gotta, you can't come there until you get the boat. You gotta dock at Safe Air Cave. And now we're going to go down and rent a raft. Obviously, our boat is too big to fit in there. Welcome, carry an inflatable raft for the day. It's cost you 50 points, what do you say? You have to do it to go ahead and get to these fish, so. Thank you for your patronage. Here's your rental insurance for the rest of the day. Okay, so. Okay, so first thing I want to do is make sure we're on the right tackle. We want the large tackle right now. Because we're going after the, the large fish. Go with the quick hitter for that. Okay. So now we want to go towards the back of the cave. Come through the opening area here. Now you see the big pillar over here on the side and this one right here. There's this one there, there's one around there. So let's try around this one. That's where you normally find the color camps, is around the pillars. They're normally hidden in the back side. Let's try on this one first. It's got a funny shape to it. Color it kind of looks like a Pudgy Castile, but it's got different fins to it. You can tell the difference when you really look at it. Hopefully we'll see one pretty soon and then I'll be able to show you. Okay, so I didn't see one around that one. And normally, if they're not there, they'll be around this pillar back here. You might well go ahead and go after that king of the heron while we're here. Have you seen him? King of the heron. Yep. Biggest fish in the area. That's not a king in here, but we might go ahead and take it because it looks like it's bigger than the one we caught before. Yeah, the first episode. Yep. Well, get our hook. Pull them on in. And then we'll go back to that pillar we want to us and see if we can't catch one of those fish. Not sure if that's the king of the herring right there is just a shadow. I can't tell right now. It must be just a shadow. It don't look to be look, moving around. Although that's a big long fat shadow, if that's what that is. Maybe we'll move towards that after we pull this fish in. Just see. It's a shark. Real shark. No, oh. well, that must be a shadow right there. You see what I'm talking about? That's a shadow. Okay, so we're going to go back out here towards this pillar. Around this pillar, hopefully there'll be some color things. Yeah, I kind of motor around and look for this this fish here, you can't just blindly cast. 
And when you want to catch it, you got to actually see one first. Dang, that could have been a... No, don't look like it. Okay. You see it there, so we'll go ahead and motor around a little bit more. You can catch, you can get quite a little bit of points for this type of fish. And normally when you're catching the first one, they're always harder to catch and harder to find. Once you catch the first one, it becomes a lot easier. It's just the way the, the fishing game is set up. So, still don't see it this time around. We'll have to go look for something a little bit different. There's still other fish for us to catch in this cave. So we're not going to give up. Let's try over here. Since it's not there, we go back over to this coast. Actually, we haven't caught one of those yet. So let's go after that one. We've got to change the tackle size. Wait a minute, that's worth quite a little bit of points. It's okay to catch that one. You catch uh, Ammonite fossil. So they're worth quite a little bit of points, so it's okay to catch that. There's actually a different type of fossil. If you catch them both, you get extra money. So that's not Let's a just thing. make it how to catch that fish, okay? See if we see it around here this time. At the next episode of this, will we go to the next world? I do. Let's see how good we do today. Yeah, catch some fish. Puggy Castillos. We've already caught several of them. There were some points. It's almost worth going after them if you can't find what you want. Let's try to find what we want first. I see one right in front of us. It's actually a pudgy cast, cast kill. Since I don't see the other one, go ahead and catch it. It's worth some points, so we might want to pull it in. And we'll motor around and try to find the fish again. I thought I'd seen it, but then it disappeared.
Oh, you cast here. There it is. See the difference? It's got a lot of different fins on it. See it? That's a cola can. Come on, come on over to my bed. Got hooked up. So you just gotta motor around that rock until you find it. A little bit harder to catch, but it's not impossible. Just keep trying. I believe that's a cold camp we got out in the hook. There was one we seen in the water, and it looked like a hook or something. We hooked it. Let's see as we pull it in. See how it swam out? They're a little harder to catch than a pudgy casquillo. Even a frilled shark. They fight a little bit harder. But the work more points. Looks like it. And all the things it has is a different looking fish. Oh, that might be an ass, the first one we caught. We want to take a picture of that. Is that the fish we were looking for? Yes, it is. We call it the cold cat. So, I guess this video's over, right? Yeah, we can. Okay, so that's how you do it. I want to show you real quick what type of tackle we use, too. An Let's show you the tackle so you know what tackle. Uh, we use the Titan X999, uh, the X009 Infinity Real, and the Quick Care Large. Thank you, and, and watch our next video. Like this if you like if you like the tips that we gave you. Thank you.